Hey, what's up? Um, I wanted to show a quick video. I'm swapping out the safety, the water cutoff in this boiler. Um, the one I'm taking out is a cycle guard, aka the psycho guard. Um, and I'm replacing it with a safeguard. The cycle guard is designed to periodically, as in every 15 minutes, it checks the water level of the boiler even when the burner's running. And that really is a problem, I think, for a proper steam install. It wastes fuel, wastes time. I've had this one on three years. It shipped a fault by the manufacturer, um, I believe, because so many steam boilers are installed wrong. This helps mitigate water up in the pipes and stuff. But I'm swapping it because it actually failed. Um, it still works as a low water cutoff as designed. It comes on, turns on the feeder, cuts the burner, comes back. But on this one, um, it's failed on the intermittent level test. That's the thing that happens every 15 minutes. It basically wouldn't exit the, the function. I think it's related to that little cycle module there. I think that contains the actual timer. If you can see that right there. Um, anyway, it's a very easy swap out. The only difference um, on the wiring is the psycho guard. Had, um, has a burner terminal um, for an optional feature, smart cycle, which is still dumb as hell. But on this one, you don't have the burner. So the only difference is you take the burner wire here and you cap it. It's the burner wire capped. Everything else is the same. And I have tested it. It functions just like it should. And now it won't um, cut the, the burner. I've been using this cycle guard for three years. I actually would recommend swapping them out um, for a safe guard. I just think it's a much better product. So for a steam system, you want the safe guard 450. And you'll be good to go.